In this video, we want to talk about advancing from second to third base on uh, ground balls. Make sure that we know how many outs there are and make sure we know where the infielders and outfielders are playing before the pitch. On ground balls, less than two outs. Any ball hit to the left of the runner that's past the pitcher, we can advance to third base. Any little short nubber slow roller down either line, we can advance to third base. Any ball hit to your right and the third baseman uh, is making a play on the ball, you might be able to go to third base. Specifically, if the third baseman started the play playing deep and the ball is hit to his left. Any ball hit in the hole between short and third, where the shortstop fields the ball and makes a quick release to first base. You might be able to advance to third base on this play. Please note that all balls hit hard up the middle. Have to pass the pitcher first before you're allowed to advance. Also, make sure on all line drives, all line drives, we need to stop and read. Read the ball before advancing. Now, a ground ball with two outs. We want to be moving on contact, except if when the play starts, the third baseman is playing even with the bag, any ground ball at the third baseman right at him when he's playing even with the bag, we do not want to go. Think about this for a second. If you advance, and then you're going to slow down as the guy makes the play, and the third baseman screws up the ground ball. Well, then what will happen is he can't get the batter runner, but he can get you, especially if you stopped halfway. So this is one play that we don't want to go with two outs. Um, we also do want to make sure that um, we're a little bit extra aggressive with two outs. Once you see the hitter swinging through the pitch, we want to be extra aggressive when we see the hitter swinging through a pitch with uh, two outs and, and uh, two strikes.